These Saudi women, we, we as Saudi women, are usually seen from the outside as oppressed and timid. But I think it goes much more farther than that. These women were probably brought up by illiterate mothers. As Ambassador Smith says, said yesterday, proper schooling for women started in the early 60s. And even at that time, it was considered a disgrace for your daughter to enroll in the educational system. These women were probably brought up to think that they were second class in all aspects. She had no aspirations other than to take care of her family. We have a new breed of Saudi females. These new breed of Saudi females are armed with the proper education that is needed. And also, let's not forget, this new breed has been brought up in a less restricted society than, than their mothers. They will ask for further reform in the system. We, we are a nation that possesses years of embedded trad, uh, cultural and traditional restrictions. And they will not change overnight. And there is change coming. But this change has to be balanced with these traditions and cultures. We cannot change that. And we should not change it. We should not disturb the balance that is there. Change will come from the Saudi women themselves. They will have to empower themselves. And this empowerment has to be grasped by the Saudi woman. It will not be given to us. We will have to ask for it. We will ask for reform. And I would like to conclude with a very important message that was said by Prince Faisal yesterday. 